Alrighty, friends, so welcome back to the phonics part of our day. So, of course, we're going to work on letters and sounds. We're going to work on nonsense words or make-believe words. We're going to uh, review our sight words. We will also uh, work on blending phonemes. We're going to review letters C and P. And the story for today is actually a really fun story. Um, the skill we're going to work on is summarize. And what that means is summarize means that I, I tell you the characters that were in the story. Okay. I also tell you like where the story took place, what happened first, what happened second, and then what happened at the end of the story. So when you summarize, it's almost like kind of telling them exactly what happened in the story without telling them like every everything. You just kind of condense it all. Okay, so we're going to do that as well. All righty, friends. So let's go ahead and get started with our letters and sounds. Okay, so we'll first do letter and then we'll move on to sound. So let me mix them all up. All right, letter first and then sound. So here we go. O, off. Good job. X, X. Y, Y, Z, Z, hey, those are in order, B, B, N, mm, J, J, A, A, mm -hmm. G, G. You know, I hear a lot of friends when they see the G, they tend to do the, uh, like the J, 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 right? G is G, okay? H, D, D, E, E, mm -hmm. S, S, great job, M, M, L, O, R, R, great job, W, W, K, K, P, F, F, Q, Q, U, U, V, V, T, T, C, K, I, I. Great job on that, friends. Excellent. All righty, friends. Let's go ahead and do our make believe words. All right. So here we go. Remember, make-believe words are consonant, vowel, consonant, and sometimes it's just a vowel consonant. Ab, ab, er, eb, reb, uf, uf, ul, ux, lux, t, ob, tov. See, consonant, vowel, consonant. D, ij. Dig, sub, sub, j, if, jif, g, e, g, gag, p, ak, pack, x, x, if, vif, p, e, b, peb, o, az, laz, As, taz, et, et, t, ik, tick, d, ob, dog, v, im, vim, b, ak, back, g, im, gim, f, ap, fap. Great job, friends. That was excellent. All right. Now let's go ahead and review our sight words. Remember it's the same six that 
we tested on last week. However, please don't stop just at, at those six. Continue practicing all of them, friends, okay? Just make sure that you practice every single sight word. All right, so here we go. First of all, when you see this word, I want you to think about what this sound makes. O-W makes what sound? Ow! Mm -hmm. Then we add the N mm to it. N, mm, ow, N, mm, ow, now. And then look here. N-O spells no, like in November. Great job. With, and with has the word it inside of it. You, banded Y says, I, my, R. Great job. What? And then look here. In what, we have the word hat. And then we also have the word hat. Those are a few of the words that we made yesterday in uh, systematic phonics. Yeah. The. And he, we, I, a, like, and, and, see, me, come, me, too. Yeah. So just continue practicing all of your sight words, all right? Okay, so let's go ahead and do our phone, uh, our blending of our phonemes, okay? So I'm going to say a, uh, some sounds in a word, okay? And then we're going to blend the sounds to say what the word is. So listen to my sounds. Uh, p. The first sound is uh. The second sound is p. Uh, p. My word is up. Great job. All right, so here we go. If, if, if. Great job. Add, add, add. Nice. T, up, t, up. Top. Very good. All right. Uh, mm. Uh, mm. Hum. B, a, g, b. Ag. Bag. Excellent. All right, friends. So really, really quickly, let's go over our daily vocabulary, Bruce. So if you add, if you were to add mushrooms to a salad, are you taking the mushrooms out of the salad or are you putting them in the salad? Yeah, putting them in the salad, sillies. All right. If milk taste sour is it fresh or spoiled it is spoiled if it tastes sour it is spoiled is a moment more like a second or more like an hour so listen again is a moment so like sometimes if you hear your mom or your dad or someone say in a moment Okay, so is a moment more like a second or more like an hour? Yes, more like a second. Mm -hmm. Now, when a friend says something shyly, okay, does he or she say it quietly or loud? So listen again. If a friend says something shyly, does he or she say it? Or loud? Yes, quietly. If you're shy, you try to not make it hardly any noise. Yeah. All right, so here we are. We're going to review our letters C and our letter P. And C makes the what sound? Mm -hmm. And P makes the what sound? P. Excellent. All right. So let's see. So I'm going to say some words. If you hear the K 
sound, I want you to do k, k. If you hear the p sound, I want you to say p. All right, got it? Okay, so here we go. Car, car. Mm -hmm. k, k, k. Pat, pat. Pole, pole. P, p, p. Great job. Whoa, you guys have great listening ears, friends. All right, how about catch, catch. K, k, k. Cold, cold. K, k, k. Pig, pig. Very, very good. All right, friends. So now what we're going to do is I am going to tell you the name of these pictures here. Okay. And you will tell me the first sound or the beginning sound. Okay. So listen to what I say. Okay. Mailbox. Mailbox. What is... The first sound you hear in mailbox. What's the beginning sound? Mailbox. Yeah, M. So I will write a uppercase M and a lowercase M. Listen for the beginning sound. Six. Six. What sound do you hear in the beginning? Mm -hmm. So that is the letter S. Okay, so we'll do an uppercase and a lowercase S. All right, so let's go to the next one. Remember, you're listening for the first sound, or the same thing is beginning sound. All right. Pig. Pig. What sound do you hear? Yeah. P. Great job. So we'll do an uppercase P. And a lowercase p. All right, next one. Sun. Sun. What sound do you hear at the beginning? Yes. Great job. Uppercase S and a lowercase s. Cow. Cow. What sound do you hear at the beginning? Yeah, great job. Uppercase C and a lowercase C. Next one. Apple, apple. What is the first sound you hear in apple? Yeah, ah. Great job. Uppercase A and a lowercase A with a monkey tail. Okay. All right, here we go. Caterpillar, caterpillar. What sound do you hear in the beginning? Mm-hmm, caterpillar. Uppercase C and a lowercase C. Then we have an alligator. Alligator, what is the beginning sound you hear in alligator? Yeah, at is A. Uppercase A and a lowercase A. And finally, we have a t table. T table. What is the first sound you hear in table? Mm hmm. The t, t sound. Great job, friends. That was excellent. Very, very nicely done. All right, so let's go ahead and read. Oh, it's time to read our big book. I think you're going to like it. It is a really, really sweet book. It's cute. Even though it's something that I don't like, it's still a sweet book, friends. Yeah, and you may have heard of it. Or maybe not. I'm not sure. 
All right, so here we go. So this is titled Mouse Shapes, and it's written and illustrated by Alan Stowe Walsh. Okay, so let's see what happens in Mouse Shapes. All right, so hold on a second. 